Coming up on Cinema KC, we take you behind the scenes, interviewing the people who are making films in Kansas City. I'm Erin McGrain. And I'm Michelle Davidson. On today's show, we'll introduce you to a Kansas City actor who was a young Clark Kent on the silver screen. And we'll show you his latest mystifying short film where he reads your fortune. But we don't need a crystal ball to know. Cinema KC starts now. Welcome to Cinema KC, your own personal film festival. And welcome to the show, actor Jeff East. Ladies, <laughs> nice to be in your presence. Now, Jeff, you've done it all. You've been in Hollywood, you've been in Kansas City. We're excited to hear about some of your experiences. Very exciting life I've had since I was 14. But I love Kansas City, and I'm glad I'm back. And I've been very busy since I've been back here. We're glad you're back, too. Let's take a look at one of your films, directed by Patrick Ray. Here is Misfortune Smiles, starring Jeff East. I see good fortunes coming your way. Really? Yes. What kind of good fortune? Well, let's let the great Oswald's crystal eye tell us. Oh. Well, I see, um, true love is just around the corner. Really? Hmm. True love. Well, it's mm. not my husband, then. Um. <clears throat> Is, is that all? Um, well, I, I, um, see. Money. Do you see anything about money? Yes. Yes, you're gonna meet someone with lots of money. Really? Yes. What does he do? He's, um, he's a stockbroker. How boring. <sighs> so, when is this all gonna happen? Wow, that soon. Yes. <clears throat> well, that's that's all I can tell you for this session. Well, thanks. Oh. Yeah. Gotta go uh, put in my two weeks at Affinitas. <laughs> thanks for stopping by. Yep. Have a super day. Yeah. How sad. Hello. May I 
help you? Uh, here for one of your consultations? Oh, certainly. Please have a seat. Okay. I'll be right back. Okay. Thank you for coming in. Oh, I ask that you pay up front. Really? Company policy. Sorry. I'll need 50 for the initial consultation. Thank you. Now, what would you like to hear? Well, I, uh, uh... I've been having some financial troubles lately, and I... Uh, I see. And you'd like to know when they're going away? Yeah, I just, you know, I want to know if there's any luck heading in my direction. We'll have more Misfortune Smiles after the break. Welcome back to Cinema Casey. We're here with actor Jeff East. And will you please read my palm? What's it say? Oh, there's more misfortune smiles. Right now? Right now. Ah. Uh, well, why don't we just let the great Oswald's crystal eye tell us? and it's kind of a waste of money. <laughs> well... You're gonna win the Powerball jackpot. <laughs> Seriously. Hey, the eye doesn't lie. Buy your ticket at 3 p.m. at Gibson's Gas on 14th Street. Anything else? Well, you're with a beautiful woman. Who? Well, she's a brunette. Tish. So not my wife. Wife? Excuse me, I have to get that. Oswald Spiritual Consultations. Hey, Chuck, or whatever the hell you're going by now. This is Howard, your landlord. Oh, hey, Howard. How's life? Well, I'm looking into my crystal ball, and it appears that you're three months behind on rent. I know, I know, Howard. I, 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 I'll take care of it this week. 
Guaranteed. You better. I gotta get to the gas station. Oh, no, no, wait! Wait! I'm not done! You started to work. But now you need a client, don't you? Yes. Yo, kid. Kid. Yo. Hey, come here. What's your name, kid? Danny. Super Danny. Hey, look, I need your help. What do you say I give you a free consultation? Huh? Man, I don't have to buy anything, do I? No. That would make it not free. Come on. Just have a seat right here. <sighs> okay, now. That's a shocker. Danny, are you planning on going to the grocery store today? No, man. My apartment's next to Taco Bell. you do, don't go to the grocery store today, okay? Tell your uh, friends. Whatever, dude. Yeah. Stay tuned for more Misfortune Smiles after the break. Welcome back to Cinema KC. We're here with actor Jeff East, and we're going to see the final moments of Misfortune Smiles. Put on your seatbelts. Ooh. <laughs> Shall we begin, my child? I'm ready. <sighs> what is it you'd like to hear, my child? I want to know 
Will I meet the man of my dreams? Yeah, Oswald. This is Alice Kruger. You ruined my marriage, my career, everything. And I want you to suffer. So get ready, because I'm coming for you. Sorry. <clears throat> Let's just see what the great eye tells us, my child. What the hell? Everything okay? Fine. Oh, y yes. I, I'm, I'm, mm. What do you see, Madame Josephine? I see a man. A man who you will fall deeply in love with. But then, but then you will, but then you will kill him. I loved it. It was so fun. Thank you. <laughs> so what's it like to be an actor here in Kansas City working on the set of an independent film? I was really nervous because um, being in Hollywood, you know, you're constantly around the pros and everything. And I came back here and I thought, okay, let's see if they know what they're doing. And I was so surprised how good and talented the guys were. Mm -hmm. And Patrick is brilliant. I mean, an artist. And uh, I've worked with a lot of fine directors and I must say he's one of the one of the ones up there on the top for me. Mm. We and think I, so too. We yeah, like absolutely. Him too. <laughs> it's great a guy. How do you stay inspired in Kansas City a long way away from Hollywood? There's so many great people here and great stories and uh, the the scenery and everything and it's cinematically it's beautiful here. And uh, uh, what I was really surprised is the amount of filmmakers that were here. Mm -hmm. uh, so I really don't have to work that hard to get people to come work with me and and it's it's great. It's a gift. 
Kansas City's a great film, independent film uh, town uh, in, in comparison to Austin and mm -hmm. um, Montreal and, and uh, Vancouver. Kansas City rates up there pretty high, and I, I was very surprised. I love your enthusiasm because we're really proud of Kansas City as well. You should be. We'll have more with Jeff East after the break. <laughs> Welcome back to Cinema KC. We're here with Superman. That's right, he played the young Clark Kent on Superman with Christopher Reeve. I did, so I was young Christopher Reeve. Yes. So tell us about that experience, working on the Hollywood set. It uh, was wild, um, and it's not just in Hollywood, it was in Los Angeles, we were in New York, we were in London, England most of the time, and we spent about a month in southern Alberta. But back then in 77, we did it the real way. We didn't have CGI, we didn't have anything fancy. They were dragging me around on wires for weeks at a time. I mean, my thighs are still hurting from that. <laughs> <laughs> it's probably an inspiring experience. It was extremely inspiring working with Glenn Ford and Gene Hackman and Brando. As, you know, as an actor, you go, wow. You know, I was blessed. And uh, I've been pretty blessed throughout my career. But now I'm back in Kansas and I'm trying to make things happen for, you know, the Kansas film scene, which I really think is gonna happen big time. What's next for you? I just did Terminal for Steve Pruitt. It's coming out next year, and I'm working on a documentary about the Pendergast and Truman years. Great. Very excited about that. Well, we're excited that you are in Kansas City making films and you're passionate about filmmaking in Kansas City because yeah. we all know we have so much talent here. You certainly do. Thank you. Thanks for having me, ladies. All right, we'll see you next time on Cinema Casey.